Well, summer break is here, which is great news, but <laughs> some students at a South LA high school will be going to campus anyway, you know, to care for vegetables and flowers that they hope to harvest in the fall. In today's Mental Health Monday, we take a closer look at how cultivating these plants is helping these students recover from social and academic setbacks. Watermelon, basil, zucchini, and more. The sprout may be little, but their impact's been huge. This garden has genuinely been one of the greatest things like this year that has happened. Rivet Sanchez is an 11th grader who's aiming high for college. My dream, yo. Staying on track has been anything but easy. Although back in person for almost a year, the pandemic took a lasting toll. My mental health was like impacted, I'd say like negatively. We noticed that many of our students experienced serious mental health concerns during COVID. Zanz Katara is principal of Alliance Health Services Academy, a charter high school in South LA. When in-person learning returned last fall, we were seeing students refusing to be in class, students lacking social skills, students not wanting to be in school. 10th grader Nevaeh Adams was one of them. I guess the biggest challenges were like social, being like social, because like I only knew my friends from a group chat, so it was like kind of awkward. And isolating. It was Ribbon who had the light bulb moment. I suggested that we should start a school garden. The school's community garden opened last fall. Students have been connecting with nature and each other ever since. It gives them a sense of pride. Students will continue to care for their plants over the summer. Nevaeh's oregano should be ready for harvest by October. As for Ribbon and her gladiolas. When they started showing red, that's what made me truly happy. To see them like bloom after so long. And that long wait between planting to harvest, Mr. Katara says it offers an important lesson. Patience is a skill most of us need to continue to cultivate, so teaching that skill to our students is definitely going to be fundamental for their personal successes when they get older. Isn't that great? And nothing yes. tastes as good as a fresh strawberry oh, absolutely. out of the garden. Or a carrot. Yes. Oh, and the tomatoes. So mm. good. And it's like really all about the fruits of their labor. Uh-huh. Exactly. I, I, good for them. I just want to... I want to share. I want them to share because yes. <laughs> it looks you so delicious, <laughs> right? All right, for more mental health resources and information, go to our website, kcalline.com.